Ready for the opener. And there they go. And one of them decided not to come out of the starting gate. And it's the Eva Money favorite, Quiet Horizon. Easy Toll's making the pace. And Bonfire Diva is not sent for that speed. So it's Easy Toll is going to stack them up behind her. In the second spot is Pals Al I Iova's in the clear from the outside. And I'm going to Bonfire Diva. And the Eva Money favorite, now 6-5 to five favorite, Quiet Horizon, made a mess of the start. And she's the distant trailer. So with the lead, Easy Toll and Pals Ally is going to apply a little pressure from her outside. And third is Iova. Bonfire Diva, despite an inside post and past speed in the recent races, decides not to go. And she's four lengths from the front. And it's about 10 lengths to Quiet Horizon. 25 and 3, so they walk along up front. Easy Toll and Pals Ally, 50 and 2 fifths. Iova third covering Bonfire Diva. And at the back, Quiet Horizon. Easy Toll and Pals Ally. Bonfire Diva trying to show a new dimension and win from off the pace. Iova's right there and Quiet Horizon with a ton of work to do. Pals Ally got the best trip, flanking Easy Toll throughout. The pace was soft, full advantage with Pals Ally. But here comes Iova to the outside being pushed on. Pals Ally confidently handled. Pals Ally, Iova to the outside. Then Bonfire Diva, Easy Toll and Quiet Horizon. Pals Ally at the 316th. Iova calling upon all that past class, trying to come and get her inside the final furlong. Here's Iova putting her nose in front, now putting her head in front, putting her neck in front. Iova! Iova's on her way to the winner's circle in our Tuesday opener. Pals Ally second, then Bonfire Diva, Quiet Horizon, and Easy Toll. Nine to five early pick three time. And there they go. Don's last call hopped at the start. A lot of Frankie C. Here's Naughty Pumpkin joining the fray from the outside. Sarah's Pride is showing a little bit of pace from the extreme outside. Then Indian Penny and Don's last call after a slight hop at the start as the last of six. Frankie C. Naughty Pumpkin. Sarah's Pride joins the leader line from the outside and she's advancing. So here's Sarah's Pride joining the leaders. And Sarah's Pride will pick it up from the inside. Frankie C. Naughty Pumpkin forwardly position. A beautiful trip for Alara this afternoon. Isolated in fourth, more than three off the lead. It's a break of more than four lengths to Don's last call. And Indian Penny at the 5'8". Sarah's Pride all the way up to the front from Frankie C. Naughty Pumpkin is third. Alara makes a move for that spot advancing. Don's last call is six lengths from the pace, and she's a length in front of Indian Penny. 25 and 4, 51 and 2, Sarah's Pride and Frankie C. Alara has been getting a nice trip from third, and here's Don's last call following after her, and then Indian Penny. They race to the 3 8. Frankie C comes away with the lead. Sarah's Pride's all done. Here's Alara and Don's last call. Indian Penny gets within five midway through the turn. Frankie C, Alara, Don's last call. Alara's making her move, and here's her stablemate, Indian Penny, progressing nicely to the outside. Still got to come and get Frankie C. She was up close to this soft pace. Frankie C and Alara, one, two. Don's last call's going nowhere. Indian Penny's into third. Frankie C, Alara's trying to wear her down. Frankie C and Alara at the 16th. Frankie C, Alara to the outside. Will it be today for Alara? Here she is. Alara, Frankie C right back at her. Holy Toledo got pretty tight on. Third race will begin the pick six. Scratch five, Miss Haley. No carry over this afternoon. A dollar minimum wager, traditional style pick six. Some changes. Race five, scratch. And there they go. Mommy Joe Dreams is showing speed with Who Asked You and Special Pal. Admire my crown behind the three leaders and Joey Big Nose. Cutting back in distance, 
is the early trailer. Who asked you in special, a pal? Mommy Joe Dreams is setting up shop from third from the outside. Admire my crowns a little less than two and a half off the pace. And it's a long ways back to Joey Big Nose. But they're going quick up front, 22 and one fifth. Who asked you in special, pal? Here comes Admire My Crown progressing beautifully along the inside. And she just showed in that maiden special weight victory. She's not afraid of punching on through and opening along the inside. And here is Admire My Crown up to the front. Special pal is second. Who asked you's back to third? Then Mommy Joe Dreams and Joey Big Nose. Admire My Crown at the 316s. And she has opened up better than two and a half. Mommy Joe Dreams now picking up her stride to the outside, joining Special Pal for second. Admire my crown. Another professional victory for her. Admire my crown in front. Special Pal second. Mommy Joe Dreams third. Who asked you fourth for the super? The double one for $22. A four three exact to $17.40. 436 trifecta. $8.95. 10 cents super. 436 tooth. And there they go. From the inside, Lalima's quickly away with Coffee Futures and Cat Glasses Kathy and Sabrine's up close from the fourth spot. Here's a dabble do in the fifth position. She's not bluffing from her inside. And Girl of Toscanova had a little trouble out of the gate. She's the last of all. Lalima and Cat Glasses Kathy are one two. Ilmar Loiza one two through the early stages. Look at the trip for Sabrine, moving into contention outside of Coffee Futures. Here's a dabble do following in the footsteps of Sabrine. Sabrine's third, a dabble do taking over the fourth spot. Then she's not bluffing, and Girl of Toscanova's the last of all, and Lalima keeps on going with her lead from Cat Glasses Kathy. Sabrine is third, and now she's getting closer with her wide charge. And a dabble do is just waiting for the final quarter of a mile. Can she come with her good run outside of Coffee? Futures. So they're in the lane, and Lalima turned out to be the pace of the race, and she has kicked clear. Sabrine's chasing her. A dabble do not doing enough. Coffee Futures up the inside. Lalima was the quickest early. Here's Sabrine, the quickest late with Coffee Futures, but the advantage is with Lalima. Lalima is the winner from Sabrine. How about Coffee? 163, $184.50. 10 cent super, 163, $494.40. The early pick three, 14, $183. And there they go in the 10 cup chalice stakes. Cruising for chaos comes away in last. A good start for Benji Brown, abounding away from the gate. Love that bird is showing good pace. And here comes Ranger Blue making a bid for third inside of Cable Ready. One with everything is second last and cruising for chaos. The favorite is the last of all, and he has a lot of work to do. He's a good eight or nine already off the pace. Love that bird. Joins Benji Brown for the top spot, and they have almost three lengths on cable ready and Ranger Blue. It's a break of about six lengths to cruising for chaos. Now picking up his stride, 23 seconds the opening quarter is not going to do him any favors. At the tail is one with everything. Benji Brown has the lead through the turn. Love that bird is second. And Cable Ready, the maiden, is getting closer from third. Ranger Blue tries to close in from the fourth spot. Cruising for chaos. Now picking up his best stride, guided to the extreme outside. Benji Brown's the one to come and catch in the 10 cup chalice. Cable Ready, Ranger Blue. Love that bird, I'll pursue. Here's Cable Ready trying to make a big splash. Cable Ready gets the lead at the 16th. Ranger Blue makes his bid along the inside, but it's Cable. Cable ready, I made it no more. Cable ready wins the 10 cup chalice. Ranger Blue was 6-1 exact of $53.50. 6-1 three trifecta, $63.75. 10 cent super, 6-1 $31.35. And there they go. Noah's Destiny is showing speed. Superb surprise quickly away from the top shelf. 30 Oysters is into third. Then Matt Doyle, Aerodromos, Kobe's Legacy. Thundering March behind them. Hutch from the rail. Farther out, MC Double R. The last two are BC Glory Days and Dancing with Jake. It's superb surprise. A narrow lead from the outside to the two path covering 30 Oysters. They build up nearly four lengths. Noah's Destiny third. Then Kobe's Legacy. Here's Aerodromos putting in a nice bid to the far outside. Matt Doyle quickens with him. 
Hutch has about six lengths to gain ground on the leader, and he is closing in steadily. Gets away from MCRR. Thundering March picking up his best stride. Then BC Glory Days and dancing with Jake's at the back. And superb surprise is the one to step up to in the final quarter of a mile. And after him, 30 are Dromos and MCRR and Hutch. And it's a frantic finish. After the unfortunate $40.50, the exact at $2,391, the trifecta $3,116.25, the superfecta four are at the post. And there they go. Swift start investment grade. Bayou Melody fires into second. Ouch, that hurts. Forwardly positioned from the inside. Then make a joyful noise. And to her flank races Betty Smile and farther out is treat her like a star. Sweet Invasion, Coup de Parte, Cateri Empire, and Jokers runs at the back. A pretty combat, compact group. Ouch, that hurt up to the front from Bayou Melody. Investment grades pushing three wide. Betty Smile is pressing 40. Treat her like a star's five wide heading into the turn. Make a joyful noise has four lengths to make up. Kateri Empire, five lengths from the pace. Three clear of Sweet Invasion. Jokers runs a length behind her. Coup de Parte's at the back. Here's Bayou Melody to tackle. Ouch, that hurt. Betty smiles into third, but she's under a drive, and she's not keeping in touch. And to her outside, treat her like a star. Kateri Empire stuck out there in no man's land. Make a joyful noise. Gets a favorable inside trip. And she's going to tip away from the inside for the final three sixteenths. But it's ouch that hurt who has got to the front and kick Claire. Bayou Melody still holding second. And they're going to treat her like a star. Sweet invasion and make a joyful noise. But here's another one for Paul Barrow. Ouch that hurt in front. Bayou Melody second, make a joyful noise third, and fourth place goes to Sweet Invasion for the $48.235 trifecta, $43.37, the 10 cent super 2354, $39.20. Pull here in the nightcap at Finger Lakes. And there they go. Smoking Alone, Margarita Sunrise, Miami Chrome, Production Credit, Magnificent Chrome, Massey Hall. These all, all six of these show speed, Margarita Sunrise is the quickest. Her special story from the rail, anything possible, is second last, and Wapiti Way is the last of all. Margarita Sunrise almost a length to smoke and alone. Production credits up close from the rail. Magnificent Chrome with a wide charge. Massey Hall with the blue silks. He's only two and a half off the lead at the three eights, and he's, th and he's threading his way into contention. And here comes Miami Chrome with a big run from the far outside. Look at him covering more ground than a jockey agent. And here's Miami Chrome with this circling move to the far outside. Massey Hall and Miami Chrome from the rail production credit. And following him, a special story production credit. Miami Chrome had to cover a ton of ground. Massey Hall with the blue silks. Smoking Alone fights on production credit. Miami Chrome continues with his run. Smoking Alone trying to get us that pick five carryover. Production credit. Smoking Alone. Miami Chrome. Who's going to win the nightcap? Production credit. Production credit for finishers. That 2 2 late double, $30.40. A 2 9 exacta from the nightcap, $95.50. 2 9 6 trifecta, $112.37. 10 cent super, 2 9 6 5, $75.55. 4 2 2 late pick 3, $103.25. 6 with 4 with 2. With two seven, six with four with two, with two seven, that late pick four, six hundred seventy-three dollars. One with six with four with two with two seven in the pick five, that's a big payer. Thirty-three hundred and forty-eight dollars. Thirty-three hundred and forty-eight dollars for that Tuesday pick five.